ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21. We got some, we got some nice news today, man. We got a developer commentary. We got Mike Wong and you, and, and you know one of the other developers. They're talking about 2K. We got some actual gameplay. So we're gonna check that out together. And uh, you know, we're gonna go over it and just see how it is, man. So if you don't do nothing else, make sure y'all like the video, man, because you know, the likes are tied to the notification system. If we don't get likes, then the videos, you know, notifications don't go out. But without further ado, um, let's just take it let's take take a look at this. Like they're calling it gameplay, and it really is gameplay, but I think it's I think it's Mike and somebody else playing, man. But uh what we're gonna do, we're gonna listen to it and listen to their commentary. I'm gonna talk a little bit into it or what have you and give my thoughts on it, and then we'll come back and give a more in-depth one. But uh without further ado, let's get right into it. Nino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me a savage. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. And here we are, man. So check it out, man. This this is where we at. Now, now you got Mike and what's called it talking, man, but uh um I don't know. Look at that. But look at that. You know what? I'm not even gonna listen to what they talking about. We just gonna go over it ourselves. Look at this, man. This is something that I wanted to show y'all. This is what I was saying. The power of SSD. They hit the start button. The game is loaded. We got the entire arena. Look how busy the arena is. Look at stuff, man. I remember doing this for NBA 2K10, man. I should have kept on doing those videos back then. I'll probably be at a million subs by now. I remember doing a video for NBA 2K10. That joint got so many views because it was like, it was like, you know, there was the first, one of the first times they had made a major evolution um, in the game. Now, and I'm not talking about with 13 and 14. I'm talking about they had made a major evolution within the normal, uh, the, 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 the current generation or whatever it was. But here, bro, look, look at what we got, man. You got Brandon Jennings, and you can see the, the things in the face. The, the, one of the major things that they were talking about right here, they were talking about lighting and how the extra processing power helps. Like you can see, you can see the sweat, you can see uh, the bulging muscles, you can see the bulging neck muscles and all this stuff, man. All of this is made possible because of ray tracing and because of the extra processing power that um, that lends itself to the lighting. Now, a lot of times when you look at this stuff, like we think that the game should just look better as in more realistic, but that's not gonna always be the case. Like some of the subtle differences that you're gonna see, like like when we come here, it's just like, I, I wish I had a side-by-side -side, uh, thing, but you see, see this right here? Oh, uh, y'all can't see my cursor, can you? Um, let me see if I can make it see cursor. So the, one of the things that you're gonna see is, see right here on the floor? This, these are things that you probably can, that you probably don't, uh, had to sneeze real quick. But like I said, you see this reflection in the floor? This is made possible because of ray tracing um, that the new APU is allowing. The APU is the GPU and the CPU put together. But you see the ray, you, that, that it allows for a more immersive um, deal. It's just like you got more processing power. So you can see all these reflections that you otherwise would not have. And it's just it's just an awesome thing to see. Everybody in the crowd has more depth. The arena seems like it's just better. You see Steph Curry go to the rim. You see that? A lot of people are gonna miss that, but look at this right here. This was something that they were talking about. Um they were talking about. You can see a lot of new features in this timing, NA. So this person that they're going with, they have elected to turn off the uh, layup timing and they and he leaves the layup timing to you know to the contest system like how how it was contest and the players rating that's what they did so the timing is in a that lets you know that that they didn't um that that's what they that, that's what they have theirs on i don't know what uh what ball is gonna have his on but <clears throat> look at that quick jab step pull up step back big greens you see the new you, you see this new shot meter you see all this stuff man you see the new green little splash animation where it's like inside of there i didn't look up, up, up under his feet or anything like that now we're running the floppy play you know you're gonna see clay thompson come up and ooh, look at that shot stick gang look at this right here it says it's slightly right and then center let's, let's run that back real quick because uh something for the shot stick gang it's gonna be under his feet no not under his feet but it is up top and you know everybody like mike said right here everybody loves their greens he got it automatically teed up and um you can see that this shot meter is a lot bigger and that the uh, green zone for these guys is also a lot bigger. Well, the, the make zone is a lot bigger. And uh, it's a little bit bigger. But like I said, it's slightly late, but it was centered. 
so we good on that and uh the art another thing that you probably that you probably didn't see um is is the art is the art on it because they said like right here obviously there's no art right so you're gonna see excellent timing 54 percent 54 percent but when you come down here and i, I should have just let this play through play through the first time but i wanted to you know i wanted to be a little more in depth so he shoots it with the stick and it says slightly late uh thinner arc flat so that means that he snatched it down uh that means that he snatched it down and it was automatically centered so that means he's using the chronos zen right there that's probably what you're gonna be if somebody's shooting straight flat arcers if they shoot them but flat arcers you already know what time it is or they list like me i just like to snatch it down every time but one thing i did like about that is that even though they said that the arc is flat that's something that you don't really have to worry about as much because it was it was just a flatter arc he just didn't shoot a rainbow shot and i think that that's important because that's something that they put into the game but you don't have to do it as much so we got that here we go screen game screen game you know right this is something that i was i was wondering about man um i do like what i'm seeing here with the screen when he comes up he's gonna set the screen he goes through the screen you're able to fight through the screen he stays with him and uh this is about right he puts his forearm in steph curry's face and says move out of my way little man now let me look at that again because i want to see was draymond even there no draymond wasn't there that's something that i was worried about man because it's like with the alleys and the contact alleys it's like all right oh my god he got oh 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 he really did put his what they wanted to do right here is showcase showcase that new alley system man the new contact alleys and also this is the new bubble cam also you know on the trolley cam but the one thing that I've, i'm wondering about is and uh that kind of answered the question for me a little bit but um i don't know how that how the contact alleys are gonna go is it is it with your dunk rating or what and he shot that with the uh with the shot stick slightly early wide open flat arc i'm seeing a lot of flat arcs um but this is one of those things that they wanted to uh, talk about let me let me let me talk about that that one thing real quick i wonder are we going to have more um like will you be able to stop those alleys will the alley ai be a little bit different or is it going to be one of those things where they're just covering up the bad mechanics with the uh shot this is one of those things those step back threes that we were talking about doesn't look too overpowered i don't know if he broke his ankle or not though so let's find out he's gonna come here behind the back step back nope didn't break his ankle and uh you know nice flat arc on that right there uh whoever's playing this they definitely zenning got a zen if you ain't zenning you ain't winning um it just is what it is uh because you know they're shooting with the shot stick it really feels like they want to push you toward the shot stick big layup uh high arc right here with this layup you can tell that that he's actually aiming aiming here so he jab step goes behind the back I don't know why the gameplay looks so slow though. It does look kind of slow, and I probably should have just let it play through. But uh, you can tell that on everything they're showcasing something. So that was a step back three, quick behind the back and stuff like that. Um, I don't know if, it, if the gameplay looks slow because of the talent of the people that are playing or what. That was a step back right there, so that's cool. Kicking it out to the top, Clay Thompson slightly left. You see him smoke that shot. Uh, you can see some rebounding interactions down here. Uh, like look at that. It looks like we're not gonna have any more of that where the ball automatically goes to the offensive guy every time you shoot the thing. I got a whole editorial going on on that, but we're gonna talk about that in another time. And here we go. Big screen, he goes, look at that. See, that's, this, this is something that I actually like. Look, he sets the screen. He's already above the screen. He's not like, like in, 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 in past gen, you set the screen right here. This is enough to cause the clipping, and then he's gonna get sucked in. But that didn't happen here. He goes around it, and uh, you can kind of see how he kind of hedges it or what have you. And then there's one of those alleys where he, you know, there's interactions on the alley, another contact alley. But like I said, I don't, I don't know. Well, it's not a contact alley. I'm sorry. It's just a normal pick and roll play, and uh, Draymond plays it pretty well. But uh, he got back late, so you know, 60% cover. And right there, he didn't use the timing. So. I don't know if that's going to be overpowered or not, but he definitely didn't use the timing, bro. And then now he's talking that smack. You know what I'm talking about? You got Ducky going to the sideline. Draymond, one of my favorite players in the league, by the way. I, I love, you know, these. And there you go. That's all we got, man. But like I said, I saw some things in this video that I really like. It is gameplay. And it's one of those things where 
I, I want to see gameplay from the gameplay angles or what have you. But it, it was it was really evident that they wanted to show us something in every time they went up and went down. And I noticed, I think I caught damn near everything they wanted us to notice. Let me know what you noticed down in the comment section, man, because I didn't, I, I'm not going to claim that I caught everything, but I know I caught a lot of it. And uh, like I said, that last one, he went up for the layup with the button. And uh, he has his layup time and turned off also because it has NA. So both of them are playing uh, quite bot-like. But anyway, like I said, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Until next time, it's your boy Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town. God speak! Commence. It don't make cash and it don't make sense Cause we can't pay rent with no one's opinion So in that sense, I never value your two cents Hey, darn, please leave that bullshit you speak at the barn Cause I ain't buying I'm only 5'8", that's fine, nigga I can give a heart transplant to a giant I ain't lying, God speak We good